Hey guys, this is Barbaros with Barbaros Gaming. Today we're going to be working in Shotcut. I'm going to be showing you how to freeze a frame. I've gotten a few questions on this, so I figured I'd make a quick little video on how to do it. It's very simple. Let's get started. Alright, so I've already got my frame picked out what I want to do. Um, so what you're going to do is once you get that spot picked out on your timeline that you want to freeze, you're simply just going to go to File and then export frame and then you're going to obviously choose where you want to save it and then I'm just going to title it W94 for Winchester 94 um, once you get it saved you're going to want to create a video track and then you're going to go to open file and you're going to find your picture open it once you open it you're going to drag it down to your timeline and now it's lined up with where you originally got your clip from and just like adding a picture you can adjust how long it is actually up on the screen for so I'll do it for two seconds Now, if you want your video to pick back up where you left off when you froze the frame, what you're going to do is you're going to... It'll let me get right there on it. You're going to go down here, and you're going to split your playhead. So you're going to use the S key, the shortcut key, on your main video clip. You're going to split the playhead, and you're simply going to drag your video to the outside of the frozen frame. So, your end result will look like this. See? It's that easy. It is super, super simple. So, we'll do a quick review, do a quick recap here. So, once you get your, your frame that you have picked out, we'll do it again, like just here randomly. You're going to simply select a part of your timeline that you want and go to File export frame name it and then once you do that open file find your frame and open it and drag it to your timeline after you've created another video track you do have to have it into another video track um, I guess you don't really have to you could put this you could put like this clip down here into here but I just like splitting up my timeline, it's just easier to look at, less confusion. So you can do it either way in, in reality. Um, but that's it guys, it's very quick, very simple. If you have any questions about this, please feel free to drop a comment down below. And if you like this video, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel already, please subscribe and click that little bell next to the subscribe button to receive notifications on when I upload new videos. Alrighty guys, this has been Barbaros with Barbaros Gaming, and this has been another Shotcut tutorial. Y'all have a good day.